music is a massive passion in my life. I was always one of those kids who uh, loved playing guitar but never really told anyone that I play guitar. Um, it's not about kind of promoting my music or becoming famous, it's just about I just love playing it um, for myself. Uh, once I finished school I uh, travelled around Australia um, just in a combi, um, surfing as I went, playing music as I went. Um, I do a lot of busking. It's not really the type of music that people want to start dancing to, it's more the music that people just want to sit back and relax to. Um, but I travelled all the way around Australia, living off my busking, so every major city or town in Australia I've kind of whipped out my guitar and opened up my case. Um, I don't know, it, it's always nice just to, for people to come up and just say that they enjoy the music. I don't like society's um, perspective that we have to kind of get married and have kids and get a mortgage and get a full-time job and work 50 weeks in a year and get two weeks off. So I guess I'm a bit of a, a free spirit to some extent. I've always been really interested in uh, very hands-on things. Um, when I was in high school, I um, decided to build a guitar for my d and project. Um, and from then on, I guess, guitar building has been a, a really big part of my life. Well, the name's Samuel Wales. So yeah, the name of my guitars is Whaler. Um, I like it, it kind of, it reminds me of Bob Marley and the Whalers as well. Historical kind of stuff in there as well. <laughs> a lot of people seem to think that uh, um, uh, guitars might be able to be whipped up really quickly because people like um, kind of the big mass producers, Martin and Co. and Maiden and Gibson can sell guitars for kind of a thousand dollars. But on average, um, a professional luthier um, will take approximately a hundred to hundred and fifty hours to build a, a guitar. Um, my first guitar took me over 300 hours, um, just because I didn't know, I, like, it was just a big learning curve. I think there's a lot of knowledge that people don't know about. Uh, people think that it's just slapping a few bits of wood together and it makes a good sounding guitar. Um, but I always say to people, people kind of think, oh, like, how, how have you built it? Like, it's very technical. I think a lot of it is just patience um, and just just understanding that it's it's not going to be finished in a day. Um, it's something which is going to take you months and months. Um, my first guitar took me close to a year to build. But in saying that, you're very silly to embark on a guitar without taking previous experience from hundreds of years of luthiers um, and, and what they've learned. It's all just experience and, and learning for yourself. Um, no matter how much someone tells you, you kind of figure out somehow a different way and you think it's better, um, but it's just whatever suits yourself. People who love acoustic guitars um, will look at the sound of the guitar and not the logo that's on it. Um, and the sound of the guitar is, is truly what the luthier, um, that's truly his logo and, and his style and his design. This is a custom guitar that I built for a friend. It's made from a flamed Queensland maple. Um, really highly figured, very, very highly figured um, maple. It's a pretty fancy guitar. Um, he wanted a lot of stuff done to it, um, which is alright, it just it takes a lot more time. It's worthwhile at the end of it um, when, when you get to look at it and, and think, yeah, it's a, a very beautiful guitar. But yeah, I would just like people to, to look at Whaler guitars and, and, and think that they're a, a beautiful sounding guitar. Um, and it's not all about the looks, even though they may look amazing, but um, it's, it's truly about what they sound like. To some extent, it's my life. Um, uh, so it really is a passion. Um, it's something that I, I love doing and it, it calms me down and uh, it relaxes me and uh, helps me through the day. Um, so yeah, I'll be building guitars for the rest of my life. I don't want to make money from guitars. Um, I don't necessarily want to have famous guitars either, I just love building guitars and sharing them with people and, um, and yeah, listening to them myself and playing them. <laughs>